Hey everybody, it's Admiral Polo here today, and I'm going to bring you guys another vlog. I'm off to do my Iron Dragons task, and um, yeah, let's mute, hold on, one sec, I gotta get to a place where I can uh, get rid of the volume for you guys, because I forgot to do that, because I was playing for the first time in months with the volume on, and uh, the new spell sounds are um, annoying to listen to. As you can see, well, probably you can't tell by just looking at it. A, I don't have a Curadel's ring because I had to use them all for teleports because Jagex hates me and they never give them to me. Although Steels were nice to me. The last two tasks, I got two rings and two Dragon Plate Skirts. Let's hope Irons treat me the same way. So I got the runes for Earth Surge or something. Yeah. I'm gonna see if that's any better than Fire Wave, because at 92 magic, that's the highest level spell I can cast. And, um, yeah, in this vlog, I want to talk about a little something that happened today in real life. So, this morning, I woke up for school, and I was looking around for my phone, and, um, couldn't find it anywhere. So, I was gonna be late for class, so I said, screw this, and left. So, I get home, and I was looking around for it. And I went to go get stuff from the dryer. Guess what was in the went through the wash? My phone. Poor me. So uh, it is now uh, not working, but it is sitting in a um, sitting in a in a bag with 402. That is my max with mage so far. Um, it's right now sitting in a bag. You know, like a rice bag. Do I know this guy? No. Sitting in a, like a rice bag because it uh, supposedly dries them out. And I am gonna go loot those blood runes like you've never seen. Getting too crowded. Yeah. Oh well. Um. So I'm gonna hope that that works. I'm gonna be a dick and steal this guy's kill. Thank you very much. And let's continue on so he doesn't rob me of a kill. And um. Yeah. So that kind of blows. Hopefully it'll work. But, I, I have no idea. So, um, as I was saying, the little red marker thing in the battery, it is, uh, kind of fucked. It is red, not white. But it is improving since I put it in the bag a couple hours ago, so I'm gonna... I know you're supposed to wait, like, 72 hours or something, but, yeah, screw that. Like, I went out, I went upstairs to my mom's room where she keeps all, like, the old cell phones that we don't use anymore, and I was going through the bag. And my old cell phone she gave to a friend of hers, it was like an NV Touch or something. I don't know if they have those in Britain, but it was, um, yeah, that wasn't there because she gave it away. My brother's NV3 was also given away. And the only phone that I could find that wasn't ridiculously old from, like, before I was born, actually, no, nah, that's probably not true, probably from, like, 19, I don't know, like, nine, 1999 or something, it was, like, split in half. Um, the only phone I was able to find was an old blackberry curve and um a i'm definitely not activating a data plan so i can use an ancient blackberry and b i can't stand the operating systems come on come on um i can't stand the operating systems those things run it they run like rim or something the browsers are horrific sweet effigy yeah great for you I'll leave me alone um yeah the the browsers are horrible and it's not worth the thirty dollars so I'm hoping this phone gets fixed even though I hate the phone I just don't want to bother paying fifty dollars for a replacement of the exact same shit phone if that happens I'd quicker just like I don't even know what I'd do I was actually looking for one of my mom's old palm prees I know she had some uh, palm phones and that runs webOS and I love that operating system it runs WebOS 3.0s on tablets and stuff. My tablet runs it, so it would be no problem picking it up and using it. Even if it was like 1.6 or something like that, I would still do that. I think it was like a Palm Pre, like the first one, not even the Palm Pre 2. But that's not going to happen because I couldn't find it. And she had a really old, like, Palm Trio, Centurio or something. I don't know what the hell it was. So that kind of sucks. Anyway, enough with cell phones. Um, so now, I'm probably going to be using my tablet for a couple days to make phone calls. It's like a 9.7 inch HP touchpad, 
and you can make calls on it. Um, you can't, well, you can text technically by email, but there's no text app on it for, like, iOS. But, um, that is going, I'm going to look ridiculous if I answer that in, like, public or, like, I'm down at Monument Square, that pizza place I always talk about, and I have to call someone. I pick up this, like, 10-inch square thing and <laughs> hold it to my ear. Yes, it's the Admiral. No, I don't answer my phone like that. That'd be fucking pathetic. Um... Yeah, so anyway, um, I'm hoping that this will work, I think I'm just going to open it up tomorrow morning, or maybe even tonight, I don't really care, like if the phone breaks, the phone breaks, I hate it anyway, it's like an LG Cosmos Touch, because if I didn't tell you guys, I know I'd get comments about that. So, moving on, so far I'm digging the spell, and um, I don't care that it's more expensive, it's faster. This guy's really getting on my nerves. Is he really trying to... Oh, it's going to get loot on Are you really trying to take two dragons? Can you imagine if Curadel's dungeon was multi-combat? My god, that would be a pain in the ass. Because there'd be those people that would, like... I don't know. It'd be impossible to get a world, though, because people would be, like, cannoning iron dragons and dark beasts and stuff. Not that I can kill dark beasts, I have no interest in killing dark be dark beasts. I want to get abyssal demons. I don't really care that the whips are 500k, it's just like a drop I want to get. So anyways, what will I be doing after Slayer? Homework. So I'll probably be doing, like, some skilling or something. Maybe even not even bothering. But I'll do something, hopefully, because um, I'm pretty sure I have a lot of homework I have to do. Um, yeah, I don't even know. I don't even want to think about it. I'll do that later. It's only like 7, actually. I don't know what time it is, because my phone is screwed. So, on the bright side, I was able to get two Dr. Peppers today. Um, I know none of you care, but they also came out with a, um, the new Dr. Peppers, like Dr. Pepper 10. Apparently, uh, like, women's rights groups and stuff are all pissed off at them, because their motto for the drink was for men only or something like that. Like, a man's... It was something about... it. Not, it's not for women, that's what it was. And they took that offensively. I'm like, eh, it's a bit over the top. And they don't actually mean that they don't want women drinking it. Of course they do. They make more money. It's normal Dr. Pepper only with 10 calories. But I haven't been able to get my hands on it because the only place I go to, uh, Monument Square, well, I go other places, but I can't buy, like, bottles of Dr. Pepper when I go out to eat. But they don't have the Dr. Pepper 10, so I'm going to have to talk to the guy that owns the place, because I know him, and I'm going to bug him until he gets it for me, because I want to try it, even though it's like 10 calorie, I don't, like Coke Zero, tried that when it came out, ugh, that is disgusting. I remember their old commercials were, um, uh, something about scientists cloning real Coke taste. I'm like, what is wrong with you people? They don't taste the same at all. Who did you have tested? A drugged up monkey? I mean, my god. It literally... I couldn't... No. N you know, you could have half your taste buds dead from, like, chewing tobacco for a hundred years or something, and you could still be like, this tastes like shit. It was awful. I don't know how they still sell it. And Pepsi Max didn't even bother trying that. I'm pretty sure it's Diet Pepsi with, like, loaded caffeine. I'm pretty sure those two things contradict each other. You don't make a diet drink and then jack it with caffeine. I mean, I think it, I swear to God, I think it's diet. At least at first, it was diet Pepsi Max. It was Pepsi with like an outrageous amount of caffeine. It was like drinking probably one of those like five-hour heart stoppers. Actually, they're called like five-hour energies, and they're only 20 calories. I'm like, yeah, but there's if you. There's probably like 90% caffeine. Only has like 4 grams of sugar, but you need sugar when you have 90% caffeine. So, now that this vlog has nothing to do about RuneScape, um, I'm going to continue talking non-RuneScape. Um, tomorrow, when I go to school, I'm going to go to Dunkin' Donuts, and if the goddamn Kulana machine is broken again, I swear to God, I'm going to kill someone. That was broken the last two Fridays I went there. I go there every Friday. I get my colada and a coffee roll, and then go to school. And last two, I've had to get, like, coffees, because the damn colada machine was broken. 
either that or they were just too lazy to make it because I you know, like they have two machines like they each make different flavors and one of them was working one of them wasn't but anyway I'm pretty sure Dunkin Donuts are really only in the US they might be in Britain I think Britain has different co coffee shops it's basically like a coffee shop well it is a coffee shop and it's normally in the northern part of the United States. There are some down in, like, Florida and stuff like that. But I think mo it's mostly, like, honeydew donuts down there. Um, yeah, this vlog is going absolutely nowhere. I just jumped from one food topic. Actually, we started about cell phones, and then I was complaining about Blackberry, and then I went on to WebOS, and then I went on to Dr. Pepper, then I went on to Dr. Pepper 10, then I went on to, oh hell, what the hell did I talk I don't even know. Uh, Dr. Pepper, and then I went to, like, Coke, Coke and Coke Zero, and then Pepsi and Pepsi Max, and then, you know, and then Dunkin' Donuts, and Honeydew Donut. This is out of control. Oh, and before I go, I'm pretty sure um, Canada's coffee shop is, like, Tim Hortons or something. It's, like, Jim or Tim. Some, like, three-letter name. I'm pretty sure it's Tim Hortons. But I'm sure some of my Canadian viewers will scream at me if I got that one wrong. And I don't know coffee shops around the world, so don't... Yeah, so don't get... You didn't mention Africa's coffee shop. I'm like, well, I don't know what Africa... Africa... I don't even think Africa has a coffee... Okay, well, that sounded a bit racist. I, I mean, I don't think Africa is like a chain of coffee shops. Like, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna stop this for right now. Uh, thanks for watching. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. And thumbs this video up because my phone is fucked.